Thanks for joining me again. Well, having recently spoken to Martine Barras, the AIS women's road coach, about the lead up to London, we can now reveal the women cyclists that are heading to London representing Australia. Chloe Hosking is going to be the sprinter of the team and she'll have some good support on the road. After her Giro debut in 2009, she realised then what it took to become a professional cyclist. And joining her will be Shara Gillo, who is the engine of the team. She's going to be competing in the road race and the time trial and will support both the other girls, depending on what happens on race day. And Amanda Spratt is going to be the third rider on the team. She is the reigning national road race champion and she's only in her early 20s but has enormous potential. Moving on to the BMX, well, Caroline Buchanan, she is talented at the BMX and also at mountain bike. She's had a spate of injuries and decided in 2011 that she'd purely focus on aiming to go to the Olympics and she's there and she's in the team and we'll need to watch out for her. And joining her is Lauren Reynolds. She had to fight very hard for her position against an equally talented Melinda McLeod. She's also talented at the mountain bike as well as the BMX. And with Caroline Buchanan, the BMX team will be very strong. And our mountain bike hopes rest with Rebecca Henderson, who has gained a string of results, especially in the last six months, with some podium finishes over in Europe, which actually cemented her position as the mountain biker on the team. She's actually amassed a staggering eight national titles since she started competing as a 15 year old and extremely exciting for her will be that her partner Daniel McConnell and coach is going to be competing for Australia as well in his second Olympic campaign for the mountain bike as well. So we really look forward to bringing you all the results as the games begin.